I'm Michelle Oka Donor. This is my fifth time with Glass Lab. I'm from New York City, originally from Miami, so much of my work here has been based on a vocabulary and language of the uh, tropical flora and fauna, and especially of the great life in the ocean. Today we're working on sargassum seaweed. We chose some very beautiful glass, for example, this which um, is amber and sand-like, and then others which have more of a dark rust tone. So the hot glass gets rolled into this extraordinary mix, I call it a stew. It's kind of a sea soup of color. So I've been fascinated by seaweed, its shape, how it lives, what lives in it, probably for uh, numerous decades. This, for example, is a specimen I picked up in Miami. What we see now is the structure, the beautiful branching pattern, and then the little balls, which are so magnificent because they keep it afloat. And the sargassum seaweed floats, it doesn't sink. Wow, fantastic, fantastic. God, there's just no stopping this group. I've worked on seaweed a couple times already because these are explorations and they're never finished. And it is a glass lab, so it's a laboratory. And that makes me very excited because I can experiment. And glass lends itself to experimentation it's fluid like water, and because of its color, it has the ability to be both translucent and articulate some of the extraordinary varieties of irons and iron oxides, tones that are found in the great masses of seaweed and sea life that I collect. The quote-unquote decorations are really the small little bladders that are found in sargassum seaweeds that allow it to float. And these little self-contained capsules of air are so magical, otherwise it could never have light, it'd never be a plant, and it would just sink to the bottom. This is so alive, I'm expecting it to crawl away. Glass has um, always been the opposite in a way, the companionable sense with water, in that fire makes the glass and you know water of course was here and present as the quencher so there's a yin and yang between water and glass that was actually very visible today that is so beautiful they are amazing amazing amazing